Hello and welcome to another Airbrush Show special from Scale War Machines. We've got another great airbrush product for review, so here's our latest road test. For today's show we're looking at the Evolution airbrush from Harder and Steenbeck. This was sent to us for review. More specifically, this is what's known as the Evolution Silverline 2-in-1. Why is it a 2-in-1? Well, it's got a 0.4mm needle and nozzle and a 0.2mm needle and nozzle. There's also two different types of cup. You can see how it arrives in a slip case. You also get some paperwork, a manual, cleaning instructions, safety instructions and so on. And inside is the silver line airbrush and there you can see it. Talk you through the features. So this is clearly a double action airbrush of conventional design. There's the two different cups that go with it. So those are easily changed and you can see there's seals there and that's it with the larger cup. Very easy to change. Quick look at the machine itself. First inspection reveals it to be very nicely produced indeed. The silver line as the name suggests it's all silver, closed body, the only aperture is there. One of the other neat features of this all metal airbrush is that the middle section is proofed against solvents so that's another advantage of the Evolution silver line. It all looks great quality. It's good to see at the end you've got a paint stop. What it does is it is a limiter really to control the stop point of your airbrush. You can screw it right forwards. That gives virtually no trouble. The more you loosen it, you can set your paint volume with precision. Other features, this one arrived with a quick release clip, but this fixing here is a standard sized connector. We'll just show you how easy it is to change any nozzle in an airbrush like this. What you'll do is unscrew the back, undo the nut, the needle comes out. You change the nozzle just by unscrewing like so. You then take the other needle and nozzle and simply screw it into place. And lock it. It's an extremely pleasant weight and sits beautifully in the hand. The trigger is quite high, but we actually quite like that. It gives you a sort of impression that you're on top of your work and it actually clears a line of sight to the subject. It's all very solid and sturdy. As always on the Airbrush Show, we review airbrushes with a view to model makers. The engineering is one thing and this is very well engineered. One of the areas you can really see that when we've taken it apart is the way it's conceived. The trigger mechanism for example, the machining is all beautifully done but how does it spray? So we're going to do a series of tests. Consistently smooth fine lines. So rest assured this is up to the job of fine line painting. And now we're going to use it on this KV2 by Trumpeter. The idea of this little demo is to show the airbrush in action on a complete model. And we're going to spray these primers from Ammo by MIG. But what you must do is you must shake them really, really thoroughly before you use them. We will very, very gently aim to cover this model with very thin coats of primer. You don't want to saturate it, cover it in paint. You'll see us just build up layers. 
nothing too saturated just even coverage it's the perfect combination the silver line is spraying really nicely and the MIG paints are very smooth you can see that the airbrush with a well mixed paint performs in an excellent manner There you go, that's the Evolution Silverline. Beautifully crafted machine, very precise, a joy to use, just the right weight, dimensions and ergonomics. It's given a very, very professional finish. It's got an excellent feel to it, very positive trigger action. And the added benefit of knowing it's proofed against all sorts of solvent paints which we regularly use is fantastic. The versatility also of having two needles and nozzles is undeniable. Stay tuned for more editions and you can also find us on Facebook at Scale War Machines, Twitter and Google+. That's all for now from the Airbrush Show. We hope you've enjoyed it. Bye for now.